Welcome back to Mr. Money Phone, buy reviews, cell phones, iPods, and other electronic gadgets. Today we're going to show you how to do a hard reset on the Motorola Droid 4, model number XT894. Uh, it's a nice phone, nice and quick. If you ever want to get rid of it though, first visit MrMoneyPhone.com. We'll pay a top dollar for this and other model cell phones. Secondly, you're going to want to remove any personal information that includes your phone numbers, photos, videos, etc. Uh, this hard reset will remove that info and restore, restore your phone back to its factory settings. Another reason you may want to do this external hard reset as opposed to an internal is if your phone is having some software issues. Uh, we can't guarantee, but it could possibly fix uh, any software glitches you may be having if your phone may be freezing up on you. Uh, this would be the first step you take uh, to try and resolve that issue. Now before we get started here I do need to warn you this process will permanently remove all information from your phone. So uh, it won't be able to be recovered. If you need that info make sure you back it up either to a uh, another phone, a computer, or an SD card because again this info will be permanently deleted. Now the first thing we're going to do here is just use the power button up top and power down the phone. Now it's always helpful to just remove the battery when you uh, power down the phone. Pop out the battery, wait a few seconds, put it back in. It just ensures that the phone is off and all the background programs are, are stopped. Okay, now we're just going to locate a couple different buttons on the phone here. On the right hand side of the phone you'll see the volume up and down buttons. On the top of the phone the power button. Now what you're going to do is hold the volume up and down button. While pressing those buttons you're going to click the power button to turn on the device. Continue holding those volume up and down buttons until the boot mode menu appears on the screen. Once the boot mode menu is up on the screen, press and hold the volume up and down until the system recovery menu pops up. If it doesn't appear, it may take a couple tries, so just keep trying until you get there. Now, once you're at the recovery screen, you're just going to use the volume up and down buttons to toggle through. You're going to scroll down to the option for wipe data factory reset. The whole purpose of this video to reset your phone back to its factory settings. So we're going to go ahead and select that using the power button. Now you're brought to a precautionary menu. This is more just to make sure you know what you're doing here. You'll see a screen with a bunch of no's and then in the middle you'll see a yes. So just again use the volume down, toggle down to the option for yes and go ahead and press the power button to select the option for yes. From there it'll just wipe the data off your phone and you'll be brought back to the system recovery menu. At the top of the uh, screen you'll see the option for reboot system now. It's always good to just reboot the system as opposed to you know taking out the battery or turning off the phone. So click reboot system now using the power button. Your phone will power down, power back up and when it does it'll be as good as new as if you just took it out of the box in the store. Well, we hope you found this video helpful. If you did, uh, give us a thumbs up. You'll see that down below. Also, feel free to comment. Uh, if, if you want us to keep making these type of videos, go ahead and click subscribe. You'll see that button up above. Thanks for watching.